So you're going to want to pay attention because there is something big to note in our latest real estate market update. Multiple signs are showing that the housing market here in the Sunshine State may be on a steady path towards some degree of normalcy. As you know by now, each month I take time to share what's happening in the real estate market right here where we live. I've told you over the last few months to stay with us during these updates because there would come a point in time where this hot housing market that we're all talking about would begin to cool off and you would need to know what, what it means for you, whether you're a homeowner or a home buyer. Well, with July's market stats, that time seems to be now. So let's take a look at the real estate market in the Orlando Kissimmee MSA to further delve into what's happening here and what it might mean for you. In the month of July, there were 3,495 active listings in the region, and this is down 43% from this time last year. However, the news all buyers have been waiting to hear is that inventory has indeed been on the rise in 2021. Since February of this year, July is the highest level of inventory we have seen. Additionally, pending sales were down by 85% compared to July of 2020, and it's actually the lowest we've seen all year. In fact, exactly 200 fewer homes went under contract in the month of July than actually went under contract in the month of June. So stability. Another stable aspect of the market has been the number of days it takes for a home to go from listed to pending. This number has remained consistent over the last few months too, and is another sign of what I referenced at the beginning of this video. Interestingly, the median sold price has effectively remained unchanged between June and July, sitting at $364,000. Now, have you heard me say every single month during 2021, we have seen sales price increases, but July is the first month we actually saw an ever so slight reduction in the median sales price. And finally, closed sales are up 2.1% from this time last year, but that actually remains consistent with what we've seen all throughout the year. Since March, we've been selling between 3,500 and 4,000 homes per month. However, July is the first month that we saw an only single digit increase in the number of sales compared to this time last year. So what does all this mean for you? Simple, if you're a buyer, pick up the phone and call me now. The market is shifting and you will wanna to talk to a trusted real estate advisor now. If you're a seller, you certainly wanna pay attention to what's going on. The market is starting to shift and you do not wanna miss your prime opportunity to sell at top dollar. Look, all in all, the market is still strong and healthy, but you're gonna to wanna to stay tuned because as things continue to adjust, shift and change, it could impact you. So until next time, I will just simply say, stay well.